Did you know these five things about river blindness? One, ladies first. River blindness is spread by the bite of infected female black flies. Female black flies feed on the blood of mammals, while male black flies feed on plant nectar. They breed in fast flowing rivers and where conditions are favorable, there can be swarms of them. Two, a single person can get bitten up to 1,000 times per day. The bites are sore and itchy, which can be agonizing. When someone is bitten by an infected fly, larvae invade the body and develop into worms. If untreated, these worms produce millions of baby worms. Three, over time, baby worms can end up in the eye. The adult worms can cause bumps beneath the skin called nodules but the baby worms are responsible for the majority of symptoms, which causes severe itching and stigmatizing skin conditions. If the baby worms travel to the eye, they can cause impaired vision and eventually permanent sight loss. Four, the black fly's favorite color is dark blue. Flies prefer this color over lighter colors and tend to be attracted to it more. People's livelihoods rely on the river and its fertile land to fish, farm and get water, to drink, bathe in and wash clothes. The irritation of repeated bites and risk of potential blindness used to force communities to make the hard choice to abandon their homes. 5. Communities are now reclaiming river basins from the ravages of river blindness. Thankfully things are improving. Today, treatments are available to protect people from river blindness, as well as other diseases such as lymphatic filariasis, intestinal worms and scabies, allowing people to take back control of their lives. Thanks to the support of communities, governments, donors and a network of partners, we are working to treat, prevent and even eliminate river blindness. But there is still work to be done. More funding and support is needed to rid the world of this painful disease. Find out more at www.sitesavers.org forward slash NTDs.